can we stop talking about Donald Trump? Because I was, I was just sitting here one day, and I turned the television on, and they have some complaint about him talking about McCain's little being captured prisoner of war thing while he was serving the uh, U.S. Navy. And I really am just so tired of hearing the same story over and over and over again. Granted, what he said was ridiculous. You, you don't... You don't say anything about this, especially about a veteran of the military. I'm, I'm not questioning that. But when you have an election going on, which is what we have right now, uh, for those of you living under a rock, and it's not going to get us anywhere. We have, what, 14, 15 Republican candidates now? Um, I think 14 are office holders and the other two are just running to run never having held an office before, which, which Trump would technically be the third one, but he's on a much higher profile than the other two. Uh, I, I don't see him, his comments, as being anything more than a distraction at this point. You know, it, it's it's really just a game of what, what will people watch for the next two or three months until we actually have a real issue show up. And that's really what this election and this primary should be about, talk, speaking on issues that have to do with the country rather than one person. I mean, it'd be similar to if on the Democrat side of the argument, Clinton was uh, was running along with Sanders and the other three guys that nobody cares about that have no shot of winning running. And, you know, they start talking about emails. It's just like that, where you just sit here for a whole month listening to the same story over and over again. You take a whole month out of this timeline of events to go and start talking about one person doesn't really get us anywhere.